Okay, so I'm going to show you how to go get some video and bring it into a uh, twin motion. I put this in as an enrichment because it's a little bit tougher and sometimes you may just decide not to do it. But uh, it is kind of cool, so uh, I'll just show you how to do it. So I gave you this website, uh, YouTube to mp3.cc. So basically, if I want to download the video file, I click on mp4. And I had found my URL here for my Canterbury Cathedral. You will have something different depending on what your site is. And you basically paste that in here and click convert. So what it will do is it will, I'll just do it so you can see it. It'll, now not all the videos work. Let's say 95% of them work. So if ever you get unlucky and one of yours is the one that doesn't work, there are other sites that you could try. You download it and, uh, Make sure you're aware where the download goes. So now we're going to go to Twin Motion, and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go and get a TV because we need to place it in a TV. So where would I get a TV? Well, under Objects, under Home, under Living Room, under Electric Appliance. Okay. So um, basically, Home. I'll go back here. So Objects, Home, Living Room, Electronic Appliance. So I'm just going to drag. It. ATV and I'm going to resize it. Okay. So, and again, the trick is F. So you see here, what we want to do is, you know, you can see 90 degrees is what you want. And I'm going to lift it out. And I think what I'm going to do is make it way bigger than this. Just so it's really obvious whenever somebody's walking around and I'm going to, do, again, I'm going to switch this 90 degrees. You see there, 70, da, 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 uh, roughly 90. Then I'm going to press the, I think it's the, uh, let's see, is it the five, six, seven key? And I'm going to really enlarge this a lot more. Okay. Like that. And it seems to be a little bit weird. So I'm going to just do it this way. I want my TV to be really big. So whoever comes in will see this no matter what. All right. So I'm going to just move around here and maybe I want to press the six key. Just place it uh, at an angle or something and just make sure it doesn't cover something important in your scene. So, you know, I don't know. It's pretty good. So now I'm going to go, where do I get the video file? It's not actually in the same area. So go back to the beginning under materials. Okay. So uh, under materials, you will see video. Now there is a default. So what you do is you have to drag the default on. Okay. Well, that's not the one I download. I don't know. I don't want that one. So I'm going to click here. I'm going to go on open and it'll show me where it is. Now you might have to open wherever it is you downloaded your video into. And let's say this is your downloads and then just click and drag it in here. Okay. So let's pretend that was it. I'm just going to click and drag it in. So that isn't the one that I want, but I already brought it in. So what I'm going to do now is click on that one and it's going to change it. Now, as you can see, the video is upside down. I'll just flip this 180 degrees. Give me a second here. Whoa, really having a hard time with it. Uh, I'm looking for the 180. So there you go. And it seems like it's a little bit on an angle. Uh, you know, just play test it. So there you go. You have a video now and uh, this is a visual. Now, I think there's no sound and I'm almost sure it's just a visual. But it is a really cool thing to have, especially if you're walking in VR. People will stop and look because, of course, your model is okay, but the real thing is so much cooler. And uh, we are focusing only on the outside, and sometimes you'll find a video, for example, with this cathedral, does an amazing job on uh, the inside and the what the five W's that uh, you're also exploring. Okay, so uh, there you go. If you have any other questions, please let me know.